I know I don't eat that much. I know. I remember. Day one of going gluten and dairy free. I just decided this morning. Um, so I am eating eggs with spinach, onion, um, garlic, cayenne, and I think that's it with some turkey bacon. So, and then I have a nice coffee, but there's just almond milk and coconut cream in there. Um, I just decided to do that, <laughs> like, right now. So hopefully I can stick to it, who knows, but I have to go back to work. Another workout completed. There's a little too many people in there to like really. What is that? It's a salon. Um, there's too many people in there to like be filming and stuff, but um, I did. I burned 170 or 80 calories in cardio, and then I. Did weights and stuff Someone and stretch. Um, but um, yeah, like my fitness pal app says I still have like 800 calories left to eat. And it's like, I know I don't eat that much. I know. And I'm like so confused of why I'm so bloated. Like I know so many more people who eat so much more than me and have like a flat tummy. So like hopefully like in a weird way, something comes back with the, the doctor blood work things. I will show what's going on. If not, I'll like look into like PCOS, which is like polycystic ovarian syndrome. I'm sorry, I'm getting angry. Um, and then, I mean, we'll see. I, I really don't understand what's going on um, because like I ate a big breakfast today and I never do that. So like I'm eating more than I usually do and I still have so many more calories left. So like Screw this, like I'm so mad. Day one of my fitness journey and I'm like, I knew it, I knew it. And like, I'm writing everything down in my fitness pal so that I can really keep track because I followed my doctor in a week and I want to be like, I don't want them to doubt me that I'm like being a typical girl who's worried about like their weight and stuff like, or not, I'm not eating healthy or whatever. Like I want him to know like I'm doing it right. So anyways. I added brown rice. I only had one and then a little bit of brown rice and mushrooms. I don't normally recommend that, but I was a little bit hungry this morning. These are vlog lattes, banana pancakes, really simple. All you need is two eggs and one banana. which are really easy to make. They don't look so cute here. I've made them cuter before, but I can kind of insert a picture of what they normally look like. But all it is is two eggs and one banana, and then I put a tablespoon of maple syrup. 
actually, yeah, a tablespoon of maple syrup. So really good, really delicious. And I will check the calorie in, um, intake on it in a minute. But working and watching the inauguration. suggesting there was fraud when there was not. Uh, so he was part of the problem even if he got religion since. So here is the vice president-elect Kamala Harris and her husband, the soon-to-be second gentleman, Doug Emhoff.
quickly wanted to come here and rant for a second before I go into the gym because I've been in a bad mood the past two days and I don't know if it's like hormones or or what I think it's just I'm I'm losing my mind because I have like lack of space in my house because I live with my parents um so like everything they do annoys me <laughs> Um, they're really loud, they're really intrusive, they don't really give me space, and yeah, that's one thing, and then, like, my computer's having issues, so, like, I have to use theirs, which means, like, they, like, love to walk in while I'm working, which is just, all the little things are really annoying me right now. Um, another thing annoying me is obviously, like, working out and, like, not losing any weight and eating it healthy, like, I'm just, I think I'm, like, hangry right now so that's frustrating um and I somehow gained two pounds in the past month or less so that's again infuriating <laughs> so I'm just kind of like losing it because I feel like nothing's going my way and I feel very stuck like I don't want to do anything but I don't want to be near my parents I want my sp my own space but I don't want to spend any money yet um, you know, I, I love you too, but you know, it's hard. Um, it's a lot of work for like 20 views, you know, um, which is fine. I enjoy doing it. I really do. But I guess, you know, I, I've seen like channels with like no videos that have like so many more subscribers. That's so a little bit odd. Um, kind of feel like the system's working against me and I know it's just a mindset, but like, I really do miss the girl who was like, elated and positive and super happy like during during the beginning of December and November like I was such a happy person and yeah I had you know space all to myself I got a job I was just very positive thinking and I am now I'm like I'm happy that Biden is president that was really exciting today but I'm also frustrated that people are still out there who still support Trump and there's people out there who still believe his lies and you know I just know that like the next four years isn't gonna be easy peasy I I could go on forever but I just kind of didn't want to come in here because I was like driving myself up a wall and I'm glad to get out of the house to like go to the gym for a bit and um then go run some errands but yeah I just wanted to hop on because I feel like obviously my vlogs are currently really spaced out and like not me talking a lot it's because my family members are around and I don't feel comfortable talking to a camera in front of them when I have like no subscribers you know what I mean like when they're not around I don't give a shit um but or sorry I don't care but yeah so that's that's why and like same goes with like TikTok and Instagram and stuff like that so anyway I'm being a negative Nancy um but yeah let's go not enjoy the gym I don't want to do it but I have to so.